In this video, I'm going to share all the resources that I'm using in order to master my interactive brokers dashboard. So here I've got my paper trading account set up and I'm learning how to use it. I want to share all the resources that I am using. Now below this video, I'm going to have this document that you can download. In the next video, I'm going to master this document and everything here I'm going to be able to do in interactive brokers. So this is a day trading basic sort of just buying and selling stocks. And I want to be able to do all of these things with my brokerage account. Now, if you're not using interactive brokers, you can certainly download this PDF and just use your own brokerage account and run through all of these things. So basic, you know, understanding of bid and ask price, what the spread is, uh, some market orders, limit orders, stop orders, and so on. So we want to be able to not only know what these are, but how to do them in interactive brokers or whatever brokerage account you're using. Stop limit order, trailing stop order, uh, short selling we spoke about already uh, on this journey. I have a link to that article here. And then we've got some bracket orders and one cancels the other orders. And then we want to understand what ETFs uh, are uh, and inverse ETFs and sort of how to trade them uh, as well. So in this PDF, I've got all the resources that I've used and all the tutorials for uh, Trader Workstation. So this is the platform that you use with interactive brokers. This is Trader uh, Workstation. So I'll just run through these quickly. I again, interactive brokers offers a lot of great information and you might as well go through these tutorials before you look elsewhere on YouTube. So there is their campus here and you can search uh, anything that you are looking for. So, you know, Trader Workstation uh, and it'll give you uh, all their sort of courses and lessons all about uh, Trader Workstation here. You've got some tax information. Uh, you've got an options course, beginners and so on. So I've kind of listed them in that PDF for easy reference. Uh, they've got a Traders Academy so you can learn um, all about the different order types. So this is a good link here and that's linked that's linked below as well. You can come here to stocks uh, and then you can understand, uh, uh, click on any of these and understand what they are. So a bracket order, you'll certainly want to understand uh, what these are and, and that's actually listed here uh, in the PDF. Uh, so this is a good page uh, here, uh, an introduction to stocks. So we spoke a little bit about that already, but you might want to get familiar with these uh, courses here. Uh, introduction to the indexes, understanding what those are, uh, introduction to exchange traded funds, uh, and then ETF trading with liquidity, and understanding leverage and inverse um, ETF. So those are the things that I'm going to master in this first phase of understanding how to buy and sell stocks with interactive brokers. Uh, and this is the Trader Workstation uh, course that Interactive Brokers offers that runs through sort of how to get familiar with this whole Trader Workstation. And I have gone through that uh, and I've done this course already. So there's uh, a beginner's intro, uh, getting started, uh, learning how to do some order entries and so on. So Interactive Brokers offer some really good tutorials and they are all uh, for free. And then the next course that I'm about to jump into is the introduction to order types. So I'm going to master all of these. And in the next video, I'm basically going to be able to run through all of these things. And I'm going to do them in a video uh, with my actual dashboard. So those are the tutorials I'm using. Uh, Everything is going to be linked below. Um, I hope that you find uh, them useful in the next video. I'm going to run through that document and be able to actually use my interactive brokers a dashboard and run through all of those order types in this paper trading account. So I will see you in the next video.